is going on guys clickwood here back again bringing you guys another madden 16 ultimate team video and guys it is monday which means new team of the week content is in the game today guys uh yes there is a brand new larry fitzgerald there's also a julius peppers a couple other elites as well uh obviously larry fitzgerald the set item that you can get that is a beastly beastly card but julius peppers if you guys don't remember from Madden 15, the linebacker Julius Peppers was unbelievable to user control. And that's what it is again this year in Madden 16. I've heard only great things about this card so far, guys. He's 6'7", a lot of speed, a lot of strength, a lot of just about everything that you would look for in a linebacker. So very, very excited to try and pull this Julius Peppers. There are still also uh, Justin Tucks in packs right now. So we're going to try and pull a couple of packs to see if we can get any of this stuff today, guys. Uh, what I'm thinking that we're going to do, we, obviously we've got all Madden packs in the game right now. I have quite a few coins, so I figure why not go in, open some packs with coins, see if we can get anything done that way. I want to open up some pro packs. I also want to open up at least one all Madden pack. So uh, why don't we try it out? Why don't we do an all Madden pack to start it off? Then we'll do maybe like a handful of pro packs, and then maybe at the end we'll try out a last ditch if we don't get anything type of all Madden pack like if we don't pull a Julius Peppers uh, if we don't pull a legend something like that in the first couple of packs we'll end it again with another all Madden pack so let's go ahead guys let's start things off here again 50,000 coins for the all Madden packs let's see if we can make it happen I kind of wish right now that I have held off and uh, actually saved up for a, a couple of those all Madden packs that I got uh, when I was doing the gifts because dude I had like I don't know like 60 or something like that of the all Madden packs so hopefully I'm able to uh, you know get something out of these because man it would really suck right now if the all Madden packs were super fire and I did not have enough of them because I traded them or I sold all of them away so uh, first all Madden pack we get pretty much absolutely jack crap to be completely honest with you, we get a Bobby Massey, um, obviously the Blake Bortles, Schefter Stars, maybe that'll be worth something at some point, but I'm not really guessing that it is. So yeah, obviously the All Madden packs were not the flames to start things off here, uh, but let's see if we can do, get anything going with the Pro Packs. I'll tell you right now guys, I have had better luck pulling great stuff in Pro Packs this year and last year than I did pulling any of the type of promo packs. So hopefully we can get some other good stuff. We get a Jimmy Ward to start things off. Um, that's probably going to be our only gold would be my guess. It looks like it is. So um, decent little uh, gold card there, but nothing really too great. I want to hear from you guys. What are you guys doing as far as like saving up cards right now? Because Team of the Year is coming out sometime soon. Um, and obviously, we've been talking about the potential of uh, positional sets coming out, you know, at the end of the actual NFL season, which is only a few weeks away now, sadly enough. Hurts my heart every single time that I think about it. But what are you guys doing? Are you saving up any specific positions? Are there any cards out there that you guys know uh, are going to go for a lot or anything like that that we should be aware of? I mean, that kind of stuff I think would be uh, pretty important for us as we're saving up and trying to uh, set ourselves up for the uh, end of the year stuff that they're going to eventually put into the game. I imagine so anyway. I guess I don't have verification or anything like that that um, they're going to do positional uh, set stuff, but they've done it every other year, so I don't see any reason why they wouldn't. We haven't really gotten anything yet in any of these packs though, man. Hopefully we can get something out of one of these. Greg Hardy, eh. Like, just, we just haven't really gotten a whole lot here in terms of pull, pulls on uh, Madden Ultimate Team. If you guys go over to my Madden Mobile channel, uh, which I have a link to it in my description of my uh, video here. If you guys go over there, I actually pulled a really, really awesome card over on the Madden Mobile side of things. But what was really funny about it is that it's not a card that's in Ult Madden Ultimate Team. As we get an Eric Ebron, Schefter Star. Um, you know, I, it wasn't in Madden Ultimate Team, so I had no idea of the rarity of it. Like, it, I had absolutely no idea that it was as rare as it was, but it was worth, like, 300,000 coins, and I just completely no-sold it on the reaction. Like, I had no idea at all. Uh, so that was a pretty awesome pull, and we get a Superlatives collectible. I was not expecting that. I actually thought those were out of the packs now, but uh, we'll be able to sell that at least, and we get a Jason Witten as well. So a couple elites in this pack at least. This is better than any uh, or any of the um, all, or it's better than the all Madden pack that we did, and it's better than any of the other pro packs that we've done, certainly. So uh, that's nice, but... Anyway, guys, like I said, I want to hear from you guys. Uh, what are you doing to set yourselves up? And, uh, you know, are there any cards or anything that we should be aware of going into uh, the end of the season here? And also, guys, uh, I asked about this on the, uh, on the uh, Madden mobile channel. What do you guys think is going to happen here in the final three games of the NFL season? Like, I can't believe that we're down to just the championship games and the uh, and the Super Bowl. What do you guys think is going to happen? I mean, Carolina-Arizona, I think, is the game that uh, I think most people have kind of considered to be almost the de facto Super Bowl at this point. Because, like, 
obviously the other side is uh, both teams are good the broncos and the and the patriots are good but i think most people at this point are kind of in agreement that the nfc is much stronger they've certainly had a, a harder road to uh their point that they're at right now the the uh, cardinals and the panthers have so what do you guys think is going to happen in that game and then on the afc side of things who is it going to be this is probably going to be the final time that we're going to see a tom brady versus peyton manning matchup who is going to walk away with the win in that epic showdown guys who do you guys have winning that one is it going to be the broncos it's going to be the patriots and also who do you think or how do you think they're going to win because like right now i just i do not see peyton manning putting the team on his back like he used to back in the day like i, I just can't see it happening i don't know man but uh, this is going to be our last pro pack here. And then we'll try and do one more all mad pack. See if we can get anything going with it. Unfortunately, we just haven't been able to pull anything really good. Our best things so far have been like a base elite Jason Witten and the superlatives collectible. Which are not really that spectacular. So we've got one more thing here, guys. And then I also do have a couple of other uh, large quick sells to do in another video. We'll probably throw that out for you guys tomorrow if you're interested. I think I've got 10 large quick sells to do. So we'll do that in a quick little video tomorrow for you guys. Be on the lookout for that. That. But in the meantime, let's try and pull another freaking all Madden pack. Come on, one time, give me a pull. Please, give me this Julius Peppers. Okay, we get an elite, and I saw the football outsiders thing at the bottom, but oh, man. I thought it was Team of the Week Julius Peppers for a second. That would have been amazing. We do get the Ron Parker, though. Uh, strong safety card. Pretty decent pull, actually. I'm okay with that. Um, definitely the best thing that we've pulled so far. And that is pretty much going to do it for this pack opening video, guys. So that's the best thing that we pulled today. Uh, let's take a look at him real quickly, see if uh, see if any of the stats stand out to me. Uh, zone coverage is solid. Hit power is not spectacular at a 76. 93 speed is really nice, though. I definitely like to see that. Six foot tall, 93 speed, 93 excel. So he's a decent card to user control, actually. But... Um, you know, he's not like the best player or anything like that. So, uh, anyways, guys, that is going to do it for this pack opening video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Make sure that you guys let me know in the comments section below if there's any other type of content that you guys want to see on the channel. Thank you all so much for all the support. Good luck pulling your packs. Hopefully you guys get a Julius Peppers or you get a collectible or something like that so that you can get closer to getting the Larry Fitzgerald. But again, guys, thanks so much. Hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to click that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll talk to you guys again soon. Hey guys, if you're enjoying my videos, do me a favor, click that subscribe button on the right side of your screen right now. Otherwise, you can always check out my previous video by clicking on the left side of the screen. Thank you guys again.